Okay, our final question about this infinite cylinder and the surrounding shell is what happens if we connect the outer surface here to ground, which means the charges there can do anything they want. Well, remember we had um, inside we have a charge, a linear charge density of minus 5 nanocoulombs per centimeter. The result of that was to put a plus 5 nanocoulombs per centimeter on the inside right here such that the electric field could be equal to zero in the conductor. So connecting this to ground, well it would allow the negative charges that we had on the outside here to, to float on off, resulting in a net charge zero on the outer shell. Nothing would happen to the charges on the inner shell. They're still needed there to cancel out the charge from the inner cylinder. So it remains unchanged.